And now, weather with Chief Meteorologist Jamie Warner. Oh, we had some jacket weather early on this morning. Temperatures in the upper 50s and low 60s. But once the sun battled through the high cloudiness this afternoon, we warmed into the 70s. In fact, we uh, got close to 80 here in Springfield, but most locations topping out of the mid 70s this afternoon. Looking at still some high clouds across southern Missouri and northern Arkansas. Rain. Uh, we had spots of rain last night. Most locations, at least across southern Missouri and in northern Arkansas, picking up a little bit of rain. And then there were some localized pockets where we may have seen, say, one to three inches there between Branson and Harrison. But the bulk of the wet weather actually was to our west and to our southwest. And this oftentimes happens when uh, you get these big areas of thunderstorm activity that develop. They sort of act like a mountain and they produce a bit of a rain shadow over the area. We probably would have seen more rain. Last night, had we not had all of that going on to our west and southwest, but uh, again, most loca most locations picking up at least a little bit of rain this morning across uh, southern Missouri and in northern Arkansas. Right now, we're just left with a few clouds. The front that went through last night is now located in central Arkansas. It's going to be heading right back to the north overnight tonight and into Friday. And what it will do is usher warmer, more humid air. Back into the area. And tomorrow it's going to feel like summertime. As much as today felt like fall, tomorrow is going to feel like summertime with afternoon highs that are going to flirt with 90 degrees. We've got another cold front that's going to be coming at us from the northwest, but this one is going to put on the brakes. It is not going to move through, and we're going to hold on to warm conditions right through this upcoming weekend into next week. Our forecast tonight looking like this just a few clouds out there. Uh, temperatures will settle out generally in the mid 60s. Looks like about 66 here in Springfield. Winds remaining breezy out of the southeast at about 10 to 15 miles per hour, and they're going to be breezy to gusty tomorrow afternoon. Uh, temperatures topping out in the mid to upper 80s with a few spots hitting 90. I think Springfield's going to be one of those locations that hits 90 tomorrow afternoon, and that's going to rival the record high for tomorrow's date, which is 91 degrees. Um, that's something we're going to continue to do, I think, uh, into next week. We're going to see those near record high temperatures with a hot pattern that's settling in. Here's what it looks like across. The nation right now. I'll point your attention to what's swirling away here in the southwestern U.S. This is going to be our next potential rainmaker because as a trough develops in the western U.S., it's going to act like a shoehorn and it's going to knock that thing out of the southwest and send it our way uh, by Saturday. And as that moves through, there will be a chance for showers and thunderstorms. Right now, I don't think chances are terribly high. And I think most of the shower and thunderstorm activity that we find on Saturday will tend to be along and north. Of I 44. What we will find though is warmth as that trough develops in the western U.S. If you remember back to about a week and a half ago, this is the same pattern that we were in, and we were looking at unusually hot conditions in that time frame. We're going to find it again this weekend through the first half of next week with near record high temperatures as we slip out of September and head into early October. Here's a peak of the high temperatures, the record high temperatures through the weekend and the next week, generally in the low 90s. And it looks like we're going to be looking at highs after Saturday's little dip in temperatures, mid 80s there, upper 80s on Sunday, and close to 90 degrees Monday, Tuesday, upper 80s, I think, on Wednesday. The next front goes through, it looks like Wednesday night into Thursday. And that'll also be our next chance for more widespread shower activity after Saturday. Uh, temperatures also looking a little cooler. I should see highs dropping back into the 70s. That's good news. I mean, we're going to have another 90 day, I think so. 90 degree day. That's just crazy to think about. Yeah. Almost October. And, <laughs> that's the way it's going this September. Viewers Club number, Jamie. All right, number tonight is 158 735 or jackpot $500. All right, thanks, Jamie. Well, still ahead. Learning.